hello you are welcome to our channels this morning let's quickly pray in jesus name lord we bless your name for these few minutes we're going to be sharing your word and uh, talking about you you are all that matters to us in jesus name we pray amen yeah good morning from nigeria i'm just quickly going to um reveal or show you an insight you know i got in this morning why i was praying with my family we used um, jeremiah 17 7 and 8 as a test to, to 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 discuss as a family this morning that please i paraphrase i was talking about blessed is the man who trusts in the lord whose confidence is in the lord I was talking about how his how he's um, how he's planted like that tree in the water place and uh, how he doesn't fear a drought and how he bring out his his fruits all the time now the fruits there for me it means testimony it means your confession because if you trust in the Lord you are not distracted by the drought all you need to talk about is the blessings of the Lord that added no sorrow so if you trust in the Lord and you have confidence in the Lord you need not to be distracted by bad news you need not to be distracted by COVID-19 news or any news in the world because he's saying trust in the is the man that trusts in the Lord whose confidence is in the Lord and he really doesn't care he doesn't fear um drought a drought means distractions bad news in countries in your country so if you trust in the lord and you want to bring out fruits good fruits of course you bring out good testimony of how the lord has blessed you of how the lord is blessing your world of how the lord is is expanding his kingdom that's the only thing you talk about that is the meaning you don't need definitely you know a man cannot be a tree a man cannot be on the water but with the meaning the revelation is what it means to you it might mean any other thing to you but this is part of what it really means it means you need to bring out positive testimonies you need to flourish all the time the world might be talking of high inflation. Nigeria might be talking about high inflation. But because you trust in the Lord. He said you bring out the fruit in all season. Irrespective of what season it is. Because your trust is not in the budget of your country. Your trust is not in the program of your country. It's not like it's against the program of your country. But it's beyond the program of your country. That is what it means. It's not like it's against it. It's not in against it. But the program of your country is subset to the program that you are working upon. Which is the program of God. So this morning, you need to work with a higher understanding. Like I used to tell uh, people in the, in, the, in, the, in the training school. I said that the, the Bible you know, the verses of the Bible you know, that does not work for you, automatically work against you. So it's better not to even know anything in the Bible than for you to know it and it's not working for you. It must work for you. Anything you read in the Bible should work for you. If it's not working for you, like I said, it's working against you. There is no there is no sitting on the fence. So this morning, as I read it, I renewed my trust in the Lord, my confidence in the Lord. And I am only permitted to say those testimonies that the Lord has done for us, has done for me, has done for you, has done for Nigeria, has done for the president, has done for the governors, you know. So that is what we are permitted to do because we are planted in the waters and our roots spring forth and we give out uh, we don't refuse to give out that testimony and what is the testimony the testimony is what the lord has done what the lord will do and what the lord is doing in your life so have a beautiful day and god bless you thank you thank you so much